guys, it's Sophie, welcome back to my channel. I am talking to you from the future. This vlog is a compilation of a bunch of different random clips that I've been filming things but not really giving intros to them and I just wanted to kind of sit down and actually explain what's happening in this vlog and give you guys a bit of an intro. So if you've never seen my channel before, I am competing in a natural bodybuilding competition in the division of bikini and I have been sick for the last week. That's my voice. That's why my voice sounds a little bit funny, but I am trying to document my entire journey through YouTube so I can look back on it one day and you know see how I was going and see what I did. So this vlog, first of all we start with I am going to reveal to you my wings for my angels division. So that is coming right now. So I just got back from my mum's house and you'll never guess what arrived. It's a little sneak peek view behind me. These are my wings. Oh my God, I was so excited. So they are made out of like, kind of like that packing foam sort of stuff. So it's super, super lightweight and it gives it this really pretty kind of um, iridescence to it where they're kind of shiny and you can see through kind of the outer layers where it's less concentrated and then it gets fuller and fuller as it goes in and they're so nicely made i'm i'm honestly so excited to wear them so this is what they look like oh hello puppy so this is what they look like and i am actually going to customize them so the theme i want to do for my angels category is kind of like an elsa inspired ice queen sort of fairy princess sort of thing <laughs> so i actually bought these little iridescent snowflakes off of ebay and they are just really really pretty really sparkly and really really lightweight as well and i'm actually going to place these in between all the feathers so i can kind of have little snowflakes all throughout and then i'm thinking about having like little dripping icicles coming off of it as well i'm still kind of brainstorming but that is my that is my plan at the moment and i'm really really excited to get started on them i'm so excited to be a little angel and prance around the stage in victoria's secret wings i think i'm the most excited about wearing those wings on stage i am just so ready to get up there and prance around and get rid of some of my nerves i think with the wings and with the angels division so i'm really looking forward to that these next few clips are from a posing session i had with emma bowman she's a posing coach in adelaide and she's amazing and this was the night that we kind of mapped out my entire individual routine and I was just kind of learning it so you guys can watch me learn my little routine and then there is another clip a little bit later on of me a little bit more recently and actually practicing that routine and I've definitely gotten a lot better at it I'm a lot smoother with my transitions so if you guys are interested in what her classes or her one-on-one -on -one sessions are like this video is for you Yeah, your main thing is just don't rushing, no rushing yeah. through all of those poses. Make sure like, oh, yeah, do that one. Well. Yeah, exactly. So if you do it um, extra slow here, yeah. then you'll be right on time. Exactly. <laughs> A few weeks ago, my really good friend Jessica Elmer did my hair and makeup for some photos we did together and I absolutely fell in love with how talented she is. So you guys can watch me get ready with her. There. Look at She's letting me She's paint her face. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, thanks. It's okay. <laughs> what a sucker. So, I just had my hair and makeup done by Jessica Elmer. She is a makeup artist in Adelaide. So, if you guys are ever needing a makeup artist or someone to do your hair for weddings, photo shoots, anything like that, I would 
highly, highly recommend. She did such a good job. I literally can't stop staring at my face. And now I just have to figure out what I'm going to wear because we're going out tonight and I get to show off this freaking beautiful makeup that she did on me. I'm really, really obsessed with it. I even told her, I was like, this is the type of makeup that I would want to wear like for my wedding. Like I feel just really pretty. Uh, I'll put all of her contact details down in the description box as well. Um, she can travel and she is so super super talented i freaking so in love oh my god <laughs> i like i just love my hair so much like i it looks so good like why can i never make it look this good so i had a photo shoot with kane crowhurst he is an adelaide based photographer he also travels to melbourne sometimes and does shoots in melbourne and he's super talented and has made me already look really, really cool and I'm not cool at all. So these are a few clips from the shoot that I had with Kane. Like I said before, this is going to be a little bit of posing practice I did at the gym and then I'm going to follow that one up with a lower body workout. It's just a few clips of my quad focus day and I'm going to talk you guys through my workout and explain some of the exercises that I did and the ones that I really, really enjoy. So first I'm going to start with squats. Now I've never had a very good squat form. I always thought I was just really terrible at them to be honest and they always hurt my lower back and I've only ever really been able to squat quite wide so sumo stance and not really been able to do narrow stance squats because my hips get really very tight. So when I did my workout with Sam from the base, he had these little platforms that you can put underneath your feet that help elevate your heels a little bit and make squatting so much easier. So I quickly ran to eBay, ordered my own, and I think it was only like $20 to get these little uh, platforms that you can stand on and put wherever you want to make your squats a lot easier. And since then, I have been squatting every single week and they feel so much better and I feel so much smoother. And I'm really, really excited to keep on building up my weights. So what I show you in this video now it's just with the bar, so that's only like 20 kilos because this was one of my warm-up sets and I'm very, very slowly each week getting a bit heavier, so I usually get up to about um, 50 or 60 kilos, but keep in mind that I weigh 50 kilos, so I'm... <laughs> So anything above body weight for me is honestly very difficult. So I'm slowly building up and I can't wait to be able to squat more and heavier and heavier each week. But this was just a start for me and I'm so excited about actually being quite smooth in my movements now. Whereas before I got a lot of pain. So I'm still working on my form but I just thought I would share that with you guys because it has totally changed the way I work out. The next exercise and one of my favorites is RDLs. I think if you've ever been to a gym, you've probably done a Romanian deadlift, but if you haven't, they are my absolute favorite all time hamstring exercise. They just feel super stretchy, super good. If you're having a bad day and you don't really want to lift very heavy, I feel like I still get such a good burn even with like a light weight with these. And then I really do like building up my strength with these as well and, and going a little bit heavier. At the end of the day, if I feel a stretch in my hamstrings, then I know I'm working them and I really, really enjoy that feeling as well because I have very tight hamstrings. And the last movement I want to show you guys 
It's just a conventional walking lunge and I know this isn't really rocket science and is one of the most basic movements but I hate lunges with a passion. They are my most hated exercise so I'm trying to implement them into my plans and build up my strength with my lunges as well because I feel like if I hate it I should include it because it means it's doing something good for me. So those were just a couple of the exercises I did in this lower body day. Let me know if you guys want to see any other workout videos or if you want me to do actual like in-depth descriptions I guess of my workouts. I don't know. I don't know if that's something you're interested in. At the end of the day, this is kind of like a beauty channel, so I don't really know if you guys want to see that sort of thing. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, I'm sorry that it is just a bit of a random compilation of everything. I've just been super busy with work and prep, of course. But my next video that's coming up, I show you guys trying on a bunch of different bikinis at Glam Fit Bikinis. So stay tuned for that. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel because I really appreciate it. And other than that, I hope you all are having a really great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.